So we are at Space Gallery. It's a large private art gallery space in Denver, Colorado. And tonight we're having our first edible event. The theme is End of Prohibition. And what makes this event unique is that it's a very high-end event. It's being fully catered and it's also cannabis friendly. I wanted to create an event where consuming cannabis is just the same as consuming alcohol. And so it's really just kind of normalizing it and making cannabis use as normal as ordering a glass of wine. So this is a chance for people to hang out in an artistic, enjoyable, relaxed environment, having great food, meeting new people, and enjoying some excellent cannabis as well. At this event, I did bring some marijuana tonight. I brought some sour diesel. Sour diesel is it just a high strain of marijuana that's kind of tasty and uh, it's a good high. We're all here for a common cause, and that's a nice thing. And we have good food and good drink and, and good people, and so it's it's really a good thing. The gallery is visually stimulating, and then the food that's being catered here taste buds, so it's kind of the best of both worlds. We saw it on the news and yeah. thought, you know, this would be really neat because I never like smoking it, but with the edibles, it's fabulous. I'm an extremely busy realtor out of state, and it just kind of mellows me out and makes me feel good. I don't like to taste the liquor. So now there's something that makes you really feel nice, no hangovers, and just delightful. I think people older are going to realize very quickly that this is not a stepping stone to be in a drug addict. That it's just a very nice thing, just like having wines. I do think that Denver, Colorado is the Napa Valley of cannabis. I think that there is so much potential here and there's so much competition to make an incredible product that there's this wonderful thing happening.